My name is Charlie Schwedler. I am the Executive Director for Senior Services. So we try to do absolutely anything that a person needs, whether it's activities, whether it's uh, meals, whether it is volunteering, uh, just to keep people happy and uh, keep them active and keep them from being lonely. So in, in regard to loneliness and health, there's an incredible connection. We see it all the time. Folks that weren't active and become active become more healthy. Uh, folks that were really, really lonely uh, and, and they become active and they come to our services, they find connections, they find uh, people to just talk to, uh, and they just become happier. It, it's obvious every day. We see it absolutely every day. The most rewarding thing for me is to see the change in people and to see folks that that are happy. My name is Janice Reed. I like coming to the senior services for the companionship and the and the um, friendliness of all the people that come here. Before I came to the senior center, I didn't do anything but sit in a chair and did nothing but watch movies on television. I came here all of a sudden, just came to the senior center and walked over to a table of ladies and said, what are you playing? And they told me what they were playing. And they, I said, do, do you play cards? And I say, well, I've played cards. And they said, do you know a king from an ace or you know cards? I said, yes. Well, then sit down and we'll teach you. So I started coming every day. And I think, what was I missing all those years? My health was declining. And now it's better than it's ever been. The best thing that ever happened to me. Do all kinds of uh, programs that are working at uh, retaining your me my memory. It's a great place to uh, be uh, during the day. We have a whole slew of opportunities for our for our volunteers. We have Meals on Wheels drivers, transportation drivers, we have friendly visitors, we have people that go to the centers on a regular basis and help out there doing whatever needs to be done. Then I ask them, why do you continue to volunteer? And they are all, I get so much more out of it than I'm putting in. I think the benefits of, of volunteering are just huge. It, it makes you feel good. It's it makes you live longer. That's something that's been proven, I think, in the research. And, and I think it gives people a connection with their fellow man. We couldn't do what we do without our volunteers. Uh, my name is Dan Thurlow. Uh, I'm a volunteer. I volunteer for uh, Meals on Wheels, uh, Team Handyman, and uh, Shared Food Driver. The first time that I went in on Meals on Wheels, uh, you go through this door into where the food is prepared. and. Uh, two of the prepared, there are many, uh, looked up and right away greeted me as if I had been there for many times. And each time we'd go through the door, you know, I, I became more aware that everybody was that way. Everybody was just glad that you're there you know, to help. It lights up their day because you care. The joy that they have, for, albeit that minute, that will last hours after everybody's left and they're all alone again. I think we need to really appreciate, someday that could be us. Something I never thought I'd be doing and I'm totally enjoying as much as I do. Loneliness can affect your health. Be sure to let your doctor know if you are experiencing symptoms of loneliness or depression. Your doctor's office can also help you identify resources like senior services that can help you make connections and feel better.